Hey, happy Sunday! Hi, hello, my name is Amy Procopus and I am an author of novels like the young adult fantasy science fiction novel The Arena and the young adult fantasy romance series Guardians of the Sixth Gate. Book two in that series is Shade of the Shadowlands and it comes out on May 30th. Arcs are up on Booksprout, so you can read that for free when you sign up as a reviewer. Wow, kind of flubbed that intro, didn't I? Today is a little bit of a different Sunday. Finn and I slept in a lot. As in, like, I woke up at 10 and then got Finn, so I don't plan on putting him down for a nap, which means that writing time is a little bit funky today. I am going to try to get some time in to write on book three. I broke through some issues I've been having yesterday. I sat down and I just started thinking about the plot. I've been having a hard time connecting point A to B and I was worried that I'd written myself into a corner in book two, but I haven't. So I figured it out. I think it's gonna be really great and I'm getting ready to write in the book where the action starts to pick up. So really excited. I'm at 69,000 words. This book is gonna be a, quite a bit longer than Guardians of the Sixth Gate and Shade of the Shadowlands. So um, lots to work on, lots to work on today, but that is the plan. So I'm gonna go inside here in just a second after I finish walking with June. I need to upload the vlog for the week and then we're gonna sit down and see how much writing we can get done. It's raining. Um, yes, it's Tuesday. Um, I just got out of work. I had to stay a little bit later to wrap up a few things that walked in at the very end of the day, but I'm on my way out. Alex has his normal Tuesday events, so he won't be home for a little while. And um, it'll be me and Ben. So I'm gonna go home, I'm planning on making a bomb stir fry and sitting down to write a lot and maybe read a little bit. We'll see. Um, I've gotten through some bigger plot events in book three and things are starting to like speed up. The action is starting to come in, um, which is really fun. So I think I'm at the point now where the whole book is just gonna go. Um, it's still really long. It's like almost 80,000 words, which is crazy. I'm thinking I wouldn't be surprised if my editor tells me to pull out some of this stuff in the early part of the book, but we'll see. It may just be a really long, it may just be a long book guys. Um, but that's the plan. I also need to do some like social media planning and scheduling because I have big time fallen off of that bandwagon. I'm doing the best that I can, but it's just not coming together the way things normally do. So a lot of little things to do tonight. Um, so I guess let's get to it. It's Friday and it's raining. Holy moly. So today is not like a normal Friday. Alex has an event that he is working. So he is home a little later. Usually he's home on Fridays, but today he's not. So it's just Finn and I at home. I have not written the last two days. I've actually been reading a really good book instead, but I do need to put some words on the page. So I think I might go home and try to get a little bit of writing done just to see what I can accomplish um, and go from there. So I'm on my way to pick up Finn. I'm actually leaving work a little later. It's 4 11 than I typically am because I had to stop and I talked with some of my colleagues, but now we're off and the weekend has started. So let's do that. Tomorrow, I'm gonna go see my sister. I have to pick up some furniture from her. So Alex and I have a brunch date, which I'm really excited about. And um, then we're leaving town. So should be kind of a nice little getaway tomorrow. I'm really excited about it. 
and um, the rest of the weekend too, because I'm hoping to get a lot of writing done. I want to get closer to the end of this book because I've hit some of the high points now and we're on the downhill slide, thankfully. It's going to be a long book. It's still 80,000 words, but <laughs> we're getting there. We're almost done. All right, on to the weekend. There's a place I have found in the shade on the ground Far from a worries and troubling sound When I go there to be by myself Only me, no one can guess what I So, I am indeed writing and I'm getting to some sexy moments that I'm super excited about because this book is so slow burn, <clears throat> or the series, not this book. This book is where all the romantic payoff happens um, and things heat up a lot. But it's taken three books <laughs> to get to it. So it's really fun to finally lean into that. Um, so that's been a lot of fun. I am not one to have to have, like I'm I'm not the kind of person that shies away from that kind of stuff it does not make me I don't know it doesn't make me blush or whatever if that makes any sense but it is still a young adult book and so I'm having to write all of these scenes I say having I'm writing them all very carefully um is what I'm doing but it's getting fun because it's kind of like a, a fun, it, not experiment, it's a fun way to write, to be honest, to, to tease the reader a bit, you know, leave things up to the imagination. I think in a lot of ways, that kind of writing is almost more gratifying than being really explicit. Just because, um, I don't know, I just think it's kind of fun to paint the picture and still leave some of the picture to the reader. So, um, that's fun. I am getting cold. I came out to let Dune out, but it is cold. So we're going to go back in and write. Alex should be home here in maybe like 30 minutes. It's almost Finn's bedtime. He's a little tired. He did get, we did get dinner a little late. I made spaghetti. Um, <clears throat> so He's eating a little late, so it may be a later bedtime for a little man. But we're back in. Let's get to writing. Happy Saturday. Finn just left with my mom. They are going on their own adventure today. Alex and I are going to visit my sister who lives about 45 minutes minutes ish away from us. We're gonna go visit her. We're gonna pick up some furniture that she's getting rid of that we are going to use. Um, so that's exciting. And um, what else? We've got that going on. So we'll probably do some shopping in a little bit. Alex and I are getting ready to leave right now. We are going to go to brunch and I am super excited because there's this really nice place in town that I have been dying to try and he's been several times. He's had work meetings there and I have not been yet. So we're gonna go there. We have reservations at like 8 45 so we're finishing getting ready and we'll head out there um, and then we're off to my sisters and adventures just the two of us. It'll be nice. We haven't had a day out like that in a while so we'll probably be there. He does have to be back because he has an event at three. So we'll be back this afternoon. And my plan is to get back to writing because last night writing went really, really well. I wrote, I don't know, a couple thousand words, I think. So it went really well. I got a lot of things written, some really fun scenes as I kind of told you guys a little bit yesterday, but um, I do plan to write when we get back. So. I am going to take you guys on an adventure with us. We are back home. Um, Alex and I are going to clean up around the house a little bit. Finn is having a really fun adventure. My parents took him to, there's a kites 
event where these really big like gigantic kites are in town and people are flying them around so he got to go watch kites take pictures with them and now there's also a fair in town um and they took him to ride rides at the fair so he's riding rides at the fair and it is adorable so alex and i are gonna get a little bit of time alone to clean up around the house and then we're gonna go pick him up and it'll be riding time Good morning. I am still in my pajamas. Um, <laughs> I just got up uh, not super long ago. I'm just kind of cleaning up around the house, getting June taken care of outside. I need to wake Finn up. We all slept in. It was glorious. Holy. I have not slept in in quite some time and I know I needed it. So I I'm very happy. My plan for today is to clean the house for sure. I need to do laundry, but I need to clean the house because we are hosting an event or Alex, I guess I should say, is hosting an event at our house tomorrow night. I have to be at something for work. So I will not be here for part of it, but he's hosting um, some people over. So I'm gonna go ahead and start cleaning that way that's taken care of and it's a little bit less to do tomorrow and of course it's sunday so that means it's laundry day so i need to get on top of that i would really like to do all of the laundry and get it put up and everything today that way it's less to lay around the house so that's i guess where we're starting for the morning and of course writing tonight is also my live stream so um, I'm going to try to write this afternoon and uh, then we'll do the live stream and write some more. So the book is going really well. I'm starting to get towards some of the, like the plot's really going. So um, I think we're getting close to the end for sure. Um, I'm not sure how much more I have to go because... Um, I'm still looking at like the plot things, but we're getting close. I know that we're getting close in the timeline to the end. So exciting, super exciting. Um, that's pretty much my plans for today. So it's kind of mushy and wet out here. Yuck. So I'm going to go back inside <laughs> and get dressed, start some coffee and get Finn ready. And then we will start into normal Sunday chores. like it's gonna rain at any moment out here. I have just started my afternoon writing session and June, of course, interrupted me to go outside as she usually does when I sit down to write in the afternoons. That is perfectly fine. It is kind of nice to get out in, I was gonna say in the sunshine, there is not really any sunshine. So my afternoon is going to be writing. I'm gonna try to write as much as I can. Um, ahead of the live stream tonight. There is a live stream at 8.20. We do that every Sunday, Central Standard Time. So join us at 
for the live stream tonight. It's super fun. I think that I'm going to leave you guys here. I have not quite gotten all of my chores done, like I said I was going to in this vlog. So that will be the beginning of next week's vlog. I still need to put laundry up. Um, it is finishing up in the dryer, the first load anyway. And I need to clean still around the house. I want to pick things up, not necessarily like clean. I just want to pick up the house because of the event Monday night. So I still have that to go. Um, but I think that we're in a good spot maybe to go ahead and end this week's vlog here. As always, thanks for watching to the end. Thank you to those of you who watch these videos every week and leave your super nice comments. I'd love to hear your thoughts, your suggestions. Um, Shade of the Shadowlands comes out May 30th. It is up for pre-order right now. I actually dropped the price a little bit, so you can go and get it. I dropped the price of all of my books today. So um, Guardians of the Sixth Gate also had a price drop. So if you wanted to read that before you got to Shade of the Shadowlands, you can actually get it for cheaper now through Amazon than before. So go check it out. You can also read Shade of the Shadowlands for free if you sign up to be a reviewer on Booksprout. So there's that. And if you follow me on social media, please do. The links are in the description box below. Go follow me. I'm really active on TikTok and Instagram. You can find a link there on all of my social media accounts for the application to be an ARC reviewer. So if you would like to read a copy of Shade of the Shadowlands and be a part of the ARC team, you can apply there. That is everything. <laughs> So thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.